What's good everybody? The Budget Collector here. Brand new NECA Pan's Labyrinth Palman. Been wanting this. Um, I did pre-order it, but I got it sooner than that by going to FYE and they just happen to have them out. Um, let's go through it. The box looks great. The detail, the artwork on the front looks amazing. On the side it just says Pan's Labyrinth. On the back, you have him sitting in his throne. Um, and it shows you the other NECA action figures coming out in the Del Toro line. And then on this side, same thing. Cool thing about the box is it does have a window, which makes so you could see what you are purchasing. And some more great art on the inside. Uh, shows him with his hands up so you can see his eyes and then you can see him in there um let's get it open and take a look here's the backdrop it looks like a fire pit in the background looks pretty good here's the throne looks really good good sculpt it's got some weight to it really looks like wood and cushion i would say that's a, a rust or a really dark red on the side. You have a ton of um, detail. Yeah, just a, a real ton of detail. Sorry, it really took my mind for a second how good that looks. I'm very, very pleased. Um, this is what I was hoping for. I guess we're having a hard time see the detail I'm hoping that's better hoping you guys can really see it even down here there's just detail everywhere in this thing it is amazing all the way through it everywhere you look very very good looking NECA did their job here all right, let's take a look. Wow, this is great looking. Um, the art is amazing, the sculpting, the painting, every bit of it I'm very happy with. Um, the folds, all the way down to his toes, everything looks amazing. Um, first time I am so far saying a perfect score. This is as close to a perfect score as I think we're gonna get. Um, Especially with NECA. Look at the hands showing off the eyes. The side of them. Yeah, there's not a lot of articulation. If you want to keep that as a gripe, I understand. But for what this was, it is perfect. Um, you can spin his head. He does have about that back. That forward. Let's go with the arms. The joints are really stiff too, but you have a double hinge right here, so you should definitely get some great articulation there. And two spots in the chest and stomach, so it could really sit well. Down here, it's very brittle feeling, so I'm not going to force it, because I really want to show this off. Alright, let's take a look how the throne looks. So it also came with another accessory, a plate with two eyes on it. Definitely looks really creepy. Goes perfectly with them. Um, let's take a look how he looks on his throne. There it is, in its throne, posed, looking good. Um, so far, I'm giving it a nine and a half. I have to knock off a half a point due to the articulation and uh, brittleness, but getting a pal man, you kind of know what you're going to get into. It's very thin, very frail, but this looks great. Anybody who was a fan of the movie should love it. Even a fan of horror should love it. Um, nine and a half out of ten. Thank you so much for checking this out. We're going to keep this one short. we got a big one coming, a hot toy. The Groot and Rocket 
Infinity War Pack. Thank you so much. Don't forget to like, comment, subscribe. Peace.